We anchored in a place called Los Cristianos, which is on the southwest coast of Tenerife. Brilliant. Brilliant. Ah. Are you going? No. Nope. Okay, I need all your attention. Yeah, yeah. what are we doing? All the that you have. What am I doing? Should I jump you're in? in? You're getting in the front. Yeah, Other go way. on. Okay. Are you good? Yeah. I'm up. Yay! <coughs> Hello! Oh, <laughs> I got that on camera. <laughs> Not paddle boarding sort of material, is it? It is, come on. Yeah. No, it's not. It's grass. No, I'm not listening to you two anymore. I told you that. <laughs> We left Los Cristianos and sailed round the corner to La Caleta to do a bit of kayaking. Getting onto the beach was okay, but when we went to get back to the boat, the swell had built and it all went a bit wrong. We completely messed up the timing and couldn't paddle fast enough to miss a couple of absolutely massive waves. Poppy was traumatised, the kayak was full of water and we were all soaked, but somehow we managed to stay in. I wish I'd been sat on that beach watching. <laughs> We sailed back to Los Cristianos for Lucas's last night and on the way this happened. Oh, there's a turtle. Lucas, yeah, jump in. Wow. Lucas is swimming with the turtle. Go. It's there. To, I don't want to scare it. No, you won't go. What if I just jump in now? And yeah. Jump on well, it? look, you're going to jump on it if you go now. So go now. Jump in. Now, yeah? Yes.
come to back to Los Cristianos in the Anchorage, and um, when we got here, there was a boat on fire. Mm -hmm. So we picked up a mooring board quick to go and help them. There's another boat there as well, and uh, everyone went back to the marina, which isn't um, for visitors; it's for fishing boats and locals. So we went back there, and then Faye phoned us, um, saying that this boat was circling ours, just shouting abuse <laughs> because we was on their mooring board. So when me and Lucas gone to come back, we explained to them what happened and they were just saying we don't care if there was a boat on fire. So I told them where to go basically. Mm -hmm. um, and then when we went to move our boat, our engine wouldn't start because um, we still haven't changed our starter motor which has been causing us problems. Yeah. <laughs> so it was all a bit of a disaster. But this is the Viking boat that you can get from San Miguel if anyone's interested. Captain's very, uh, very nice, and the crew also. Um, they know a lot of English. Most of them you wouldn't want to say in front of children. Yeah. <laughs> but we we was helping someone, so I don't really care no. whether they're upset or not. To be honest, and that's pretty much how that went. And we couldn't help the fact that our engine didn't start. Well, we could. We could have changed our start motor, but in this instance, right now. No, in this instance, <laughs> it wasn't technically. So, bye guys. Yeah. The happy day with the Ragnarok. <laughs> so, Lucas, it's your last night. You've come out for a decent meal. Ours is very unhealthy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and this is Lucas's. Have you had a good week? Oh, the awesome week. Yeah? Yeah. Awesome. Good. We will miss you. I will miss you a lot. We had loads of fun with Lucas and he bought us this picture to remember the week. This artist made this in literally two minutes. It was amazing. The next day, we sailed around to San Miguel so we could refuel, fill up with water and also give the boat a good clean. So we've cleaned the boat, everything's done. Um, these are all the cloths that we used. <laughs> but the boat's now spotless and we're gonna go and take Poppy on a big walk. Let's go.